So we're talking Google in this video. Um, you can use your personal Gmail account for a lot of things, but sometimes it's helpful to have one that's separate. So if you'd like a SAU associated Gmail account or Google account, um, you can email online learning at saumag.edu. There are, I think, uh, quite a few benefits to having a Google education account, and that's what you'd get through the school. Primarily, Google Drive is pretty close to unlimited. You can jam pack it, and I, I, I want to say it's really close to like 100 gigs. Um, you can. Uh, what's nice, and if you're not familiar with Google, a lot of the tools are super easy to collaborate with others or to share and receive files. So Google Drive, you could make a folder and send a link out to your students and they could add things to that folder by link. Um, once you sign into a Google, any Google page with your SAU account, uh, your menus up here and in the top right corner. Um, another thing about these education accounts is you pretty well get access to all of their tools. Um, I'll just talk, talk about a couple of quick ones for Gmail if uh, that's pretty well disabled on campus students don't have access to it at all it's enabled for faculty because that's needed for Google Classroom Google Drive is your online storage space Docs is their word processor which is great um, it auto saves as you're working or if you have a new document that you want to work on with someone else you can both be typing in the same place at the same time. Uh, the same goes for their uh, Sheets app, which is like Excel. Slides is their PowerPoint version. Um, and, and the good thing about most of these tools that where you're creating documents or files is that Google will let you export them in Microsoft formats or in a PDF format. Um, and Sites, that's one I'll just point out. If you typically have portfolios from your students in face-to-face -face classes, you could use that tool um, to allow students to build a digital portfolio. They're able to upload files, embed videos, and then they can send you a link to it, and it kind of appears as a web page. Uh, of course, there's some chat and meeting options there. You do get uh, access to YouTube through your uh, SAU account, which is, uh, if you want it separate from your personal, if you're using YouTube, that's great. Hangouts is chat. Um, I do. I will talk about forms for just a second. Forms, uh, you can use that to send out a form to, your, well, a, a list of questions uh, to your students. So if you wanted to say, when would be the best time for a voluntary meeting online? You could send that out through a Google form, and they can reply on pretty well on any device, and then you'll get those responses. You can also use it to collect files from students. It'll give you the option to, instead of inserting a question, you can insert a tool that allows them to down, or upload a file. And those all go into one space where you can access them. So just to recap, if you want your own Google account that's uh, not a personal one but associated with the school and all of the tools that comes with it, all you have to do is email online learning at saumag.edu.